After a gutsy come from behind victory that saw the Oilers win on Long Island for the first time since December of 1999, the team is back at it tonight here in Detroit with Jesse Pugliarvi, Zach Cassian, and Chris Russell nicked up. Tonight we'll see Anton Slepyshev and call up Taylor Beck draw in. On defense, Dylan Simpson has also been recalled from Bakersfield, but the D should remain the same as last night. While in goal, Jonas Gustafsson returns to his old stomping grounds as he makes his first start in orange and blue. I don't look back uh, in the past, whether it's, you know, good record or bad record against teams or places or whatever it could be, you know, there's always going to be a great challenge when you go out and play in the NHL game and, uh, uh, you know, there's nothing new there. If anything, I mean, just early, keep it simple and uh, let ourselves uh, have a chance to get into the game by getting some four checks and um, putting pucks on net and uh, getting those second, third opportunities. I mean, it's not not anything really too different than what we should be doing uh, on a normal night, but uh, just tonight I think it's important just uh, keep it simple, not uh, hurt ourselves with turnovers. In every situation. Benning throws it towards the net, he scores! Tipped in front, Patrick Maroon makes it a 2-1 game. I think game by game, I'm just a little more confident. Uh, the guys definitely helped that. Uh, D partner last night, Reg, just talking a lot to me and uh, making it easy out there. Tonight quite likely marks the last time the Oilers make an appearance at Joe Lewis Arena. This has been an unkind building to the Oil in recent years as the team possesses an 0-7-3 record in its last 10 and hasn't won here since December 3rd of 2009. All time at the Joe, the Oilers are 20-34-5 with three ties in regular season play and are 5-2 in the postseason. In Detroit, Tom Gzola, Oilers TV.